from the Friendship Factory and welcome to the 25 day Christmas craft challenge where we challenge you to make as many crafts as you can for this Christmas season for your family and friends. Please stay tuned at the end of this video for the chance to win the ultimate craft prize from the Friendship Factory worth over $300. Also, if you make this craft today, please post your photo below so we can check it out and see how you did. You can do any variation you like and that's the cool thing about it. So today I'm going to teach you how to make this bracelet out of safety pins and beads and just a little bit of flexi string. So look how awesome it is. It glimmers in the light and it doesn't even look like safety pins. And it's just a beautiful bracelet that you can make any variation of for your family or for this holiday season. Before we get started, I'm going to show you which materials you'll need for this project. You'll need a pair of scissors, some tacky glue. I use this kind, it's my favorite kind to use, but you can use any kind of glue that will hold on strong. Make sure you get glue, it's very super important. You'll need two of these flexi strings. I got mine from my image bracelet maker, which is made by the Friendship Factory. And it will need to be about the length of your forearm. So about that long and two pieces of it. Make sure you have two. You'll need a bunch of safety pins. I used about 45 for my bracelet. If you have a thicker wrist, you can use 55 to 65 depending on what you would like to do. And then you'll need a bunch of different colors of beads depending on what you want to make. You can get smaller packets or larger packets. I got this big thing of the small glass beads, which is what you need. I got this big thing for like $10 at Michael's. Okay, so to start this project, you just need to get all of your safety pins in a pile and take one and undo it. So undo your safety pin. And then if I were you, I would put all of your beads, take them out of the package and put them in some sort of bowl. And then all you have to do is kind of take your safety pin and you see how the beads got on there so easy and just run it through there if you want an assortment of colors. If you want the same color, you're gonna have to individually pick them up and put them on there. So make sure you're careful with the safety pin because they're obviously sharp. But you see how I filled it to the top of that? I fill it to almost the top and then I'm going to close the safety pin just like that. So it's pretty cool. You can sometimes fit a little bit more. You see how there's a space right there. I could probably put one more. It looks really pretty already, but it doesn't look like it's gonna be a bracelet yet. So you're just going to continue to do that over and over. Now that you have 45 of these safety pins covered with beads, you're going to place them on your table and kind of spread them out. And if you want them in a pattern, like I want mine to be every other color, so like I want mine to be like this, you just place them in the pattern that you want them in. And that really doesn't matter yet, but I just like doing that. And you're going to take your tacky glue And right where you see the pin going into the safety pin part of it, the pin goes right in here. So you're going to put some glue into each and every single one. Now this can get kind of messy, so you're gonna have to push the glue in the hole like this, just kind of rub it around and then you're going to make sure that the safety pin looks clean and clear and usually this will just 
dry on clear anyways, but it, you want it to look really pretty. So you're gonna let that dry and you're gonna do every single one of them. It's a little time consuming for this, but just do every single one of them because we want no stabbage. We don't want it to open up on the person that you give this gift to. So we wanna make sure that we glue them really good and um, even though it takes time, that's a very important step. So we're just gonna keep gluing. Okay, now that you've glued them all down, make sure that you let them sit for about 15 minutes because you wanna make sure the glue is completely dry and make sure that um, everything is set in. So you are going to take your two pieces of stretchy string and you're going to start putting the bead, beaded safety pins on here. Make sure that you're putting it on here so that everything is facing the same way. So you're going to put it through this hole. Put it through all the holes of the top of them. So you want to make sure that all of the beads are um, facing you. Just like this. So now that you have all of your beads strung onto this flexi string through the top holes, you're going to do the same thing to the bottom holes. Just be careful because you don't want to make these slide off. So you're going to do the same thing to the other side. Now that you have both ends through the loops on either side of the safety pin, you're just going to take the one side and be very careful because it's so easy for them to slip off. You're going to tie together each end. So you'll kind of fold it over onto itself like this really tight and then take the other side and tie the other side together. See how you're tying the same side together? And you're just going to tie that one together once, very tight, and then twice, just double check that it stays. Then you're going to bracelet and I've made a bunch of them for my family and friends so I hope that you make them too for your family and friends. You can do lots of variations of colors. You can make them for younger kids or for adults and it's a great gift I think. You guys have a great night and always remember to choose friendship. Right Lily? Yeah. Oh they're not choosing friendship right now. <laughs> I hope you enjoyed the craft we made today. If you love crafting as much as we do, make sure you check out all of our Choose Friendship products. And to enter to win the ultimate craft prize valued over $300, just follow this link below. We wish you a very happy holiday season and always choose friendship.